our viewers who are all over the world love books. Do you have any books that you've read uh, that have made a huge impact that you'd want to recommend to our viewers? If I had to pick one book, mm -hmm. um, a book of literature to um, uh, recommend to anyone, mm -hmm. it, it is Charles Dickens' uh, Bleak House. Mm -hmm. uh, that, that was uh, my favorite book. Why? why? Um, I, I think it's, it's classical literature. Mm -hmm. as, a, as a work of literature, uh, it is beautifully uh, written. Um, also, um, I suppose, as one who was also attracted to law, uh, it, uh, it uh, deals with a, a, a lot of legal stuff. Mm. Uh, this estate which is administered forever and ever until the money runs out and showing the injustice of um, uh, the, the English system mm. at, at that time. But the more modern book uh, that uh, I uh, uh, enjoy uh, reading is uh, and Gook is devil on the cross. Mm. So uh, the younger people are less likely to relate to the dance. Mm. Uh, Charles uh, Dickens Bleak House would probably, f uh, particularly those who are politically mm. minded, mm. those who yearn for a sense of justice and who sort of would want to look at African society sometimes in satirical terms, mm. uh, then that's the sort of book that uh, I have read uh, several times. Wow. And the third one? Uh, the, uh, the third one, I probably uh, would recommend you are back to uh, the one perhaps also with I, I quote uh, more often than uh, most is uh, uh, Shakespeare's uh, Macbeth. Mm -hmm. um, I, I, I think it is a classical uh, book in terms of uh, depicting our our lives, the particularly the tragedies in life, where you say this one a flaw in an individual, and I see it all the time, mm -hmm. a tragic flaw, mm -hmm. which leads to the to the demise of an individual. So, so I still read uh, Macbeth uh, to this day. Wow. Because, uh, I, I, it reminds me uh, of the obligation each one of us mm. to identify our uh, weakest spots and work on them and ensure that they do not overwhelm mm. our lives.